are such an asshole. Well, Captain, I'm a 21-year-old male living with parents helping around the house due to my mother's recovering from disease. I'm graduating from college this spring, debt-free, because I did all my general education at community college during high school. Hey, there we go. Smart kid. All right. I was originally intending to become a physical therapist, but two weeks ago I changed my mind when physical therapists notified, when PT notified me about the policy changes that are coming up. Long story short, I decided the debt is not worth becoming one despite of PT. God, I'm charged. Okay, new policy. You fucking millennials and you fucking Gen Zers. Don't fucking okay boomer me because I'm not and this is a fucking legitimate criticism. You do this. Blah, 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 blah. That's good enough said. And I don't, it doesn't make any fucking air. You're getting charged extra. When PT notified me about the policy changes that are coming up, long story short, I decided that debt is not worth becoming one despite of PT, despite of PT telling me that I had a lot of potential and willing to hook me up with internships. I want to know what job should I go to. Right now, I'm a PT aide and a soccer referee for young, young, no, no, okay. Unless you're getting paid for that soccer referee bullshit, knock it off, okay? Okay, if it's how you get out and you socialize, that's one thing. But if you think that's going to lead somewhere, you, I owe it to read. If you're giving back to the community, one, go in a mirror, look at your nuts, kick yourself there, and knock that fucking shit off. You do not have the time with a sick mother that gave it back to the community. I'm telling you this because I have good people skills. <laughs> No, you don't. I have patience with people that are recovering from strokes to adults being lunatics and being more immature than me. I'm not your typical soft-skinned millennial. That I believe. But I do have physical limitations due to my spine injury that I'm slowly recovering thanks to my research and the PTs who charge me not a single penny, no thanks to college. Also, I live in an area of demographics help. Get the fuck out of there. What jobs can potentially can give potentially a lot of money in the long run, also requires than much of physical demand. <laughs> Serious. What jobs can give potentially a lot of money in the long run, also requires than much of physical demand. How about learning fucking English and stop recording into this thing? Fucking God. So I asked, why can't you become a physical therapist? And we're talking physical therapist, a personal trainer. Find out it's physical therapist. Uh, I'm leaning away from physical therapist career because it requires three years of schooling and a huge amount of debt with a salary that could be earned in another career with not that amount of debt. I think it was foolish of me to stick with this career. Why did you? Did you not know it was going to take seven years? Look, I'm not expecting, I understand most parents today fucking suck. I get that. I understand that teachers are not only worthless, they are fucking damaging because they lie to you and they but come on guys, you don't, I don't care how propagandized you are, you must have the logic and common sense to, before I go down this career path, how many years of schooling do I need? Now you're about to graduate and just now you discover it's three more years? <clears throat> I can't help this level. It's not stupid. It's ignorance. This is ignorance. I can't. I was going towards engineering at the age of 18 because I went up to linear algebra in my community college. Okay, that's good. But I had this injury which made me pursue kinesia. Oh, fuck. There is good news. Okay, kinesiology isn't a degree. Yes, it is. Shut the fuck up. Not you. I'm talking all the fucking idiot kinesiology majors or sports medicine, sports management. Oh, the bag of dicks store is right down there. And you get the extra large bag of dicks. You get the gross amount of bag of dicks and you choke on every single one of those motherfucking things. The good news, <clears throat> we're going to put a spin on this. I'm not trying to be optimistic because I'm not. It did help cure your spinal injury. So that's good. Or remedy it significantly. So this may not have been a complete waste. And it isn't. It isn't a complete waste. But what? Wow. 
why did you switch out of a good degree to go into king that's like that's like all these fucking mental cases. Well, I'm going to major in psychology and become a psychologist because I'm fucked in the head. I want to figure out why I'm fucked in the head. And then secondarily, maybe I'll get around to helping people even though I'm fucked in the head and I can help people because I'm once again fucked in the head. Oh, God. I, I'm, I just can't help. Oh. We need a fucking war. We need a big-ass fucking war to make everybody much stronger than this soft pussy out Pollyanna bullshit. Right now, I am want to know. <laughs> right now, I am want to know what I should do. I will have more freedom as my mom is recovering because I take one out of my three siblings to his soccer games. If it is not him, it is somebody else. I take the opportunity to referee if there is a game close by and at the same time. I'm willing to spend some money on certifications, but not on a degree anytime soon. Okay. If you're not willing to go to school, what you're going to need to do <clears throat> is uh, two things. You're going to need to work, and I'm just going to assume your parents are taking advantage of you because your mom is injured or has a disease she's recovering. So I understand that. If you got a younger brother or sister who has a driver's license, fuck you. You don't have the time to be chauffeuring people back and forth. Uh, I'm granting you one social activity like coaching soccer, but if you're doing that again to give back to the community, you don't have time for that. Okay. So you're going to not go to school anymore, all right? You graduate, get your degree, okay, get your bachelor's degree, okay, that'll help out a little bit. But you're not going to school anymore as, as you don't want to. And then you're going to work. I don't care what it is. Preferably security guard, something at night that allows you to study at night, study on, on the side uh, and focus and sit there. But I am not going to tell you what to do for a living. There are hundreds of thousands of professions, okay? I can't tell you what to do. That's up to you and your own personal fucking choices and preferences. If, if everyone's going to come up, what should I do? Um, there's a cult called the Clary Cult, and you should become a member. Give up all your personal belongings to the Clary Cult and worship thy Lord, thy God, Cappy. That's what I'm going to tell everyone to do. What you're doing is you're the standard lazy fuck, which you're not in behavior, but now you're slipping back into laziness. You're too fucking lazy to go out and research what the fuck you should do for a living. I can tell you and guide you once again what not to do. And you look like you're doing the right thing in engineering. You're going down the right path. But God, oh fuck almighty, really? Really? You, I, I am so sick of the fucking laziness. What should I do? I don't want to even think or research or go online or spend the time to figure out what should I major in. And this is the number one mistake high school kids make. They don't want to spend the time researching. It's just, oh, I, I like to do this. And they don't bother researching what it takes where the degree goes and what's required of making it in that profession. Then they come out and some of them find it, well, oh, it's not working out. What should I do? I don't know the fucking first thing you should have done before you declared your major the first time. Research the fucking job. Research the fucking profession. Research the fucking degree. What should I do? Cult of Clary. There, that's my answer from here on out. Cult of Clary. What you need to do is spend, yeah, it could take a whole year. I tell people, spend an hour a day, or not an hour a day, an hour a week researching a profession you're interested in back when you're in high school. But I'm not everybody's parents, and parents are fucking, my seriously, we might as well be putting bullets in, pe in parents' heads, right, or just whisk them away, we shouldn't kill them. We could just whisk them away to parent land, leave the kid, they'll be just as well off. You need to study what you want to study and become. And the only thing I could tell you is don't do stupid shit. Don't major in dumb crap. So no more sociology, no more, and you weren't doing this, 
But what's wrong with you going back and getting degree in engineering? You have your prereqs out of the way. Your options now, I mean, let's just go over the basic ones again. It's the trades, the military you can't join, I'm going to assume because of your, um, your spinal injury. You could become a CPA going into accounting. If, if it's not too bad of a spinal injury, maybe you become a, a truck driver or something. You can go work for the railroads. You work in the oil fields. You can do the self-education route with IT and programming and coding and computer networking. You can go that realm where it's just taking tests. You self-study. Uh, and you know what? It's a journey, man. It's a path. You have to do the work to find out what you want to do next. I can only tell you these, these general areas is where you might want to do your searching and your research. These areas definitely off the list. No teaching, no English majors, no creative writing majors, none of the shit, frankly, that American women major in as a group. There are some excellent women that major in STEM and accounting and God bless them. But don't fucking come to me. What are... It's the same fucking shit I've been saying this entire time and common sense would dictate. Professions that have degrees, I'm sorry, that have payment in the end. And if you want, take a job you might be interested in, search the job title and BLS. It'll take you right to the BLS. It'll give you the median pay, right? It's a number one. Let's try this. I wonder. Let's see if I have webcam girl. BLS. Let's see if that even comes up. Webcam model. Oh, the BLS doesn't have it yet. Let's try uh, security guard. BLS. Will it work? Wow, here we go. It makes $28,000. Right here, the first fucking bit of data. No, you know, uh, that's not a lot. That's not enough. Twenty-eight grand a year. So there you go. STEM. Trades, <sighs> trucking, transportation, out going to places where no one else wants to go because it's far removed. Don't major in stupid shit. And I can't tell you anywhere because you are, you are an individual. Unless you're not. Unless you want to give thyself to the church of Cappy and give all your worldly assets to me, and then I will tell you and for soul go doeth thus thou did. So you either are an independent human being with decision making and thought and agency, or you're a fucking robot. Choose. And, and that's it. I can't, I can't do it. I'm glad that, you know, I, honestly, I'd look back into going to physical, maybe you just need a year off. Okay, go work, make some money. Shore up your finances. Make sure your mom's doing okay. Spend some time researching. And it may be you decide, you know what? What do physical therapists make? Is this worth three more years? Oh, look, I probably did more research in this one Google search than you did for the entire fucking degree you wasted four years on. Physical therapists. 88,000. Uh, I don't know if that's, yeah, doctoral, that's not worth it. What about nurse practitioner? Those make more. I wonder what kinesiologist makes. What do they make? <laughs> well, they, they could be real doctors. I'm talking kinesiologist. Is that an actual doctorate? Exercise physiologist. Oh, 49,000. <laughs> Hey, you guys can make as much as me. <laughs> oh, man. All right, there we go. Everybody buy this book. Problems go away. See you guys later. Toodles.